I mean, knowing Devon Banks is about the seventh grade, he's been my inspiration on and off of the court. I mean, on the court, he can make a shot wherever you need him to. And he's always clutching games whenever you need him to as well. Off the court, he's my inspiration because he brought his grades up from a .7 in middle school to a 3.0 in high school. He's really changed a lot because he's trying to see himself with a better future. I agree with this. I mean, also, just look at this picture real quick. In that picture, I was about 5'6", and now I'm about 5'9". Look at him right there. It shows him like he's four feet tall, and now he's about six feet tall. His body's progressing, so so does he. He wants to be somewhere in life. Who did I kill specifically? Hi, I'm Devon's counselor from Oakland High School. As we worked on Devon's uh, academic plan in ninth grade, um, I saw that he was very focused. He wanted to go to college. I'm impressed with his wisdom, motivation. He works hard to achieve anything he sets his mind to, and that could be anything from getting good grades to even simply getting his uniform. Uh, it means a lot to him. Yet very humble, and I think whatever he chooses to do, he will do very well, and I'm very proud to be his counselor. I'm right now I'm at University High School. I got invited to this little camp here, so I'm about to see what they're talking about and hopefully I can pick up some more exposure. Finished up the workout, now I'm gonna go home, hop on bar real quick, go home, ice, and finish up tomorrow. I mean, growing up in the streets of Oakland, you got guns, drugs, violence. I could go on and on all day about how bad Oakland is, but I kind of actually like it because it's some motivation for me to see what not to yeah. Also, I help the youth, um, my younger team. I play for the San Leandro Lions, my AU team. I also play for Team Apex, but um, the San Leandro Lions, my younger team, I also train them, take them through physicality drills, free throws, all that to get better, to work on their game. It's called skills and drills, a little thing we do on the weekends. Um, yeah, so I just like helping them out, getting them better, seeing stuff from their point of view, even learning stuff from them, even though they're in second, third grade, you could pick up little things a lot of ideas that they have and add it to my game.
I haven't seen her in a couple of years now, um, ever since she's been off in college. So it should be a fun experience for me to go see her and get on this train too. There's my train. Yeah, yeah, uh -oh, yeah, 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 uh -oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Devon was born in preemie, so he's really small. I think he's actually the smallest of all of my mom's kids, but he's currently the tallest one, standing six feet tall. But technically he started off at a disadvantage because he was a small baby, he was just a small kid. Even in high school, he was pretty small, but he's much bigger now, obviously. We had a hard life, he had a hard life. There was a lot of drugs and violence. In the neighborhoods that we lived in, we couldn't afford nice places, so we had to live in the hoods. We had to live in the ghettos. It was real tough. Um, but even through that, he was like a diamond in the rough. He just wanted to succeed at anything that he attempted. I remember he used to skateboard, and as a kid, he used to like play like 16, 17-year-olds and like take their boards and skates because he like master tricks before them. And there was this point in time where he was super like hooked on Guitar Hero and he was able to like master the majority of the songs on Expert and it got to a point where he didn't even have to look in order to like hit all of the right keys and controls that but that's because he had a lot of drive like he's always been really dedicated and if he decides to do something he's gonna practice and practice and practice and practice until he masters it. Um, as far as school he you know he doesn't really like books too much. But his passion for basketball has been able to carry him throughout the years. And I think that'll be what helps him to succeed as far as his academics. Because he just loves basketball so much that if it means that he has to do an essay, he's going to do it. If it means that he has to like write a report or read a book in order to get good grades so he can play basketball, like he's going to get it done. Chicago, and it's a boring bookstore, man. I'm trying to leave. I do not like books. You can learn, you can get a sketchbook, sketch and stuff. Sketch work. Sketch basketball, little boy. <laughs> we finally left Barnes & Noble, that stupid bookstore. Now, we get to just relax. I'm gonna go take a nap. I don't know what you're gonna do. gym right now so I ain't got no hoop shoes on so I finna just shoot around and take it a little bit light I'm not trying to get injured or nothing Yeah, I 
they got like newspaper for the menu. This is like kind of different. I like it though. Everything is fine, guys. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. What classes have you been thinking about majoring in? Um. Like kinesiology, business, and stuff like that. That's good. I just okay. want to go to a college where I'm going to play high level basketball. Yeah, I feel it, but make sure you focus on your academics too. You need to know that you're passionate about, so it is too much such a task. Yeah, that's what you mean. Okay, well, thank you for coming. Thank you. to make sure you check and verify that the classes and the major you want are at the school set you're applying to. Train is gonna take off in a little bit, so I'm gonna head back to Oakland and back on the ground I go. I love my sister a lot and she knows it. Yeah, we grew up in a rough household with no dad and a mom that was always struggling. Can we use that as an excuse for why we don't make it in life? Uh, maybe. But are we going to use that as an excuse? <laughs> nah. Are we going to use it as a motivation for us to get out of this place is the question. Wait, I'll answer that for you. Yes. <laughs>